Well, it would seem, since I've had a shower, Zuzanna has just disappeared. She's, she's nowhere to be seen. She's, she's not under the bed. She's not on the other side of the bed. She's not behind the curtains. <laughs> she's not gone outside because the door's still closed. She's not behind those curtains. I don't know where she is. She's not in the bathroom anywhere. I wonder where she could be. Oh, I do wonder where she is. I wonder if she's going to come out from behind the chair <laughs> at some point because our toast is burnt. And I want some breakfast that isn't burnt. But <laughs> anyway, morning! Hey guys, how are you doing? It is a gorgeous day. You alright? Excellent, because I, if I was you, I would go out and enjoy this. Why the candle? Oh, brightness. Oh, look, isn't that a nice day? Yep, blue skies. I can't believe it. It's going to be 28 degrees today. It's the final day of the Paralympics. David Weir currently is on the road trying to go for his fourth Olympic gold medal, which is just awesome uh, from the Weirwolf. And yeah, there's loads of stuff happening today. Just going to kind of be a relaxing, chilly out day, but trying to get a lot of stuff done but none of the stuff's very strenuous, so it's gonna be all right. And maybe even a little bit later on, I'll set up the camera on normal filming mode and uh, try and do a shade press-up challenge and see how far I've come along and see if I can do more than 52, which is what I managed the other day when I filmed it in slow-mo and you didn't get to see any of it. So um, I'll try and do that a little bit later on, but right now I'm just gonna go sit in the garden with Susanna and enjoy this sunshine. It's, um, what time is it? It's 20 to 12. Too early for a glass of wine, isn't it? Bleh, starting to feel a bit crap, actually. Um, I think the Chinese that we had last night was very, very nice, but may have gone a little bit overboard or something because my tummy feels a bit unsettled and Zuzana has <laughs> just collapsed on the bed. <laughs> She's out for the count. Um, that doesn't mean don't have errands to run. And got a friend's birthday party tonight, so I'm going to try and go to that, but I'm not sure because, yeah, feeling really crap. But still got to do these errands, otherwise nothing's going to get done today. So into town and let's do some uh, shopping and come back and read that text. Oh yes, what better way to spend a Sunday afternoon after being pretty much relaxing and just writing stuff and Susanna's been sleeping, so she's very lazy. What better way to spend our Sunday afternoon after all of that hardship than sit down, watch the Aristocats, on the telly and a nice big Sunday roast with my very own homemade gravy and it is lovely and alcoholic which is even better I'm gonna sit down and eat I'll see you afterwards that was probably not a good idea I now feel sick again that wasn't a good idea I've eaten too much and I feel just as rough as I did this morning, in fact, I started getting hot sweats. Did, did I put chilli? I've just tipped you upside down. Uh, did I put chilli in that dinner or something? Mm. Yeah, yeah. I'm getting hot sweats going on. <laughs> meant to be going out tonight for a friend's birthday. Um, and that's meant to be in about an hour or so's time. If I don't make it, happy birthday, Richard. Hopefully you've had a very nice evening with pizza and everything. Um, but fingers crossed I do come. But I don't know. <laughs> if I feel like this, I ain't moving anywhere. Um, but right, I'm going to sit down and watch the geese in Aristocats, so I'll see you in a bit. Wow, you blew them out in one go! Rich, that was impressive, mate! <laughs> that, is so that is awesome! Yeah. Yeah. Lisa gets such cool things, she has animal balloons and this. It's because everyone appreciates the maturity of Rich, you see. Yeah. But at least I got to blow the candles out. Rich, that was class, mate. Oh, blimey, I can't believe it. That's it. We just uh, watched the uh, Paralympics closing ceremony. Uh, I got home from uh, Richard's birthday party uh, where we had his cake and everything else like that, where you just saw. Um, and then we just sat down and watched the Paralympic closing ceremony. And that's it. It has been the most phenomenal summer of sport ever in the UK. It has been fantastic. It has brought the nation closer together. It has made people happy. It has been so awe-inspiring watching some of the Paralympians and the Olympians compete as well. And um, people I know, people have won medals that I know. 
and it's been awesome. Um, and here's to four years time when everybody's going to get on a plane and come to London again um, and hopefully Rio won't notice. Fingers crossed. Yeah, that's not going to happen, is it? Anyway, it's time for bed now. Uh, I'm up early tomorrow morning for my training session uh, so that I can start my next four years training right now. So I will see you tomorrow morning. Sleep tight, don't let the bedbugs bite, sweet dreams. And although I didn't do the press-up challenge today, I promise I'll do it tomorrow. Okay, see you tomorrow, guys. Bye! You're watching Stop Jabbing On. So thumb the shut up. He's logging here, stop jabbing on. Like, what up? He's from the UK and he's anything but boring. Stop jabbing on, starts his day with a...